Today I'm going to be biking around the Netherlands with a stranger, but not just any stranger. My name is Jelle Bakker, I'm the Bicycle Mayor of Utrecht, and today I'm going to show you around my beautiful city, which is, by the way, ranked number one bikeliest friendly city in the world. So for this video, I wanted to explore the bike culture of the Netherlands. The Netherlands is famous for being the world's cycling nation, where there are more bikes than people. 22 million bicycles for 17 million inhabitants. Do you see how many bikes there are here? There's so many. I've never seen this many bikes in one place in my life. And as someone who lives in the US, where driving is our primary form of transportation, especially in Los Angeles, I was curious to experience this world-class cycling country. So I casually hit up the bicycle mayor of Utrecht to see if he'd show me around, and he said yes. So here's how it went. Nice to meet you. So good to meet you. Welcome to Utrecht. Thank you. Can you please introduce yourself to the people that of don't course. know you? My name is Jelle Bakker. I'm the bicycle mayor of Utrecht. I've been the bicycle mayor for two years. And today I'm going to show you around uh, the city, beautiful city of Utrecht. But first, we're going to get you some bikes. Cool. And then two questions. Can yeah. you explain what is the bicycle mayor? Because we don't have that in the US. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, what is that? So bicycle mayor is basically an advocate for, for bicycle progress. So the thing is, like, people think that bicycles can make real progress in society for a lot of challenges. So there's an entire network of 150 bicycle mayors of which I'm one all over the world. And they're all doing like a lot of advocate uh, work for, for cycling. And in Utrecht, a lot of people cycle already. So my main job is to make sure that it's very inclusive, that because of how busy the bicycle path is, that no one feels excluded. Perfect, cool. Yeah. Excited, this will be the first yeah, time. Go. All right, let's get it. Oh, and you just put them on here too. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, All right. cool. What's so the game plan? Go. Let's grab a coffee first. Okay. Then we're gonna think about what we're gonna do today. There's a lot of people living here, but yeah. still it feels like a village. Yeah, this is nice. So yeah. once you arrive at your destination, you have to lock your bike, which is really important because otherwise it gets stolen. So what you do, you grab the key, you just turn the key back, put the lever down, and you take the key out. And that's how you lock a bike. Okay. So we got our coffees. Yeah, cheers. <laughs> cheers. All right, let's discuss the game plan for today. Yeah. Yeah. What are we going to do? How are we going to do this? So I brought two dices, and I thought we can throw the dices and then let the dice decide where we're going to fight. So for example, if we say the white one is for uh, turning left and the right one is for turning right, and we could throw the dice, and for example, it says the sixth street left and the third street right, and then we could go that way and just to see where we end up. And that way, we let the dice decide our day. All right, I'm down. Let's do it. All right, let's go. We're here with our referee, Jerry. <laughs> the uh, cousin. Yeah, he's the cousin of Isabel. And he's our dice throw. Just throw it, man. Let's see where we go. All right, so this was left. So the six street left. Oh, we just throw this exactly the same. But all right, so this is this is our plan. Six street to left and uh, third to right. All right, we're officially starting this journey. All right, so we go left. And then we start with the 6th street left and the 3rd street right. Do you know the city super well? Yeah, like the back I know of your it pretty hand. well. I know it pretty well, yeah. yeah. All right, so this is one. One. Well, the buildings are cool. That's unique right? about Netherlands. Uh, oh, this is two. This is a six. Okay. So we go to the left. Left. We have no other, yeah. but yeah. And now let's continue going straight until the third street. One. Oh, that's one. <laughs> yeah. Two. All right, this so is three. This is three. Ah, it's a good place to be. This is a nice one. Thanks, Dices. Yeah. It's nice to be here. What is this area? The part yeah, of the canal? Yeah, this is the uh, Amsterdam, uh, Amsterdam Rhein Canal. Yeah. So this is the canal from Utrecht to Amsterdam. So cool. if we were to go all the way, follow this canal, we'll end up in Amsterdam. <laughs> First stop that the bike took us to. That's kind of cool.
All right, so you pull it back, then you pull the lever down. Okay, cool. All right. Whoa. Yeah. Are they allowed on the same? Okay, let's get a seat. First stop of the day. Maybe over here. Yeah? Yeah, let's do here. 31st, 90th. Yes. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Cheers, Chris. Oh, cheers. Oh, oh. I already took a sip. <laughs> no. Cheers, guys. <laughs> Nice. Where did we end up? What is this restaurant? Have you been here before? Yeah, I've been here before. So yeah. this is a sort of a city beach. So it's called Soya, and uh, that means Strand Ogenal. So the beach in uh, Ogenal, which is a neighborhood in Utrecht. Actually, there's not not a lot of things around here. So I'm actually pretty happy that it brought us here. Yeah. And now I guess our dice throwing guy is going to throw the dice. Where are we going next? <laughs> All right, he's back and he's throwing Where the dice. Where are we going? There we go. Alright, so we're okay. gonna go Port Street to the left, to the left huh? first Street to the right. So this is one of the bigger suspension bridge for cyclists and mm. pedestrians only. And this is the school and it's built on top of the school, you see? Mm. Wow, where did it take us? Well, thanks, Dices. Beautiful place you've ever seen. Wow, okay. Landed at a beautiful, beautiful construction site for number two. <laughs> but for us, for us, nothing to see. Yeah, right nothing now. much here. Nothing much here to see. So, let's go. Throwing dice. Throwing dice. All right, number two. <laughs> Throw it up in the it air. like a gambler, yeah. like a street gambler. <laughs> Throw him in the air. Woo! All right. Five. Wow, five. Fifth street left and what? the sixth street right. We are at our next stop, ice cream shop. Oh. Oh. <laughs> we have the Tom Cruise ice cream. And Tom Cruise is a Dutch pastry where it's like pink jelly on top, like a sugarish jelly. And it's cream in the middle and then it has a cookie layer. Yeah. And they made an ice cream out of it. Yeah, good. Okay, okay great. Thank you. you like Wonderful. It's great, yeah. Good. Okay, got our ice creams. Cooling up. What's your favorite thing about biking? I think it's just you're so much faster than walking, but you yeah. still have the freedom of mobility. Like you can easily get into the city center or you don't have to park your car. And uh, yeah, it's just a feeling of freedom, I guess. You feel the wind through your hair, especially on a warm, sunny day as today. So good. Like you feel like revitalized. Yeah. yeah. Okay, so that was just a pit stop to get the ice cream. We still need to continue on to get to number six. Is it six? Mm -hmm. Okay, six. Six, continuing Six on the journey. Six straight right. Six straight right. Three. Four. Four. Look, this is a cargo bike. Cargo bike, oh yeah. You can just rent this one and then we put Jerry in front. <laughs> Bam, show it. What do we got? One. Yeah. Two. Second street left and then one to the right. This is where they made the money. It's a coin building, but they closed <laughs> it, but it's still a museum. And then we're around the spot where we met this morning. It's a lot of bridges. A lot of bridges, a lot of water. Right turn here. Okay, let's stop here for a moment. Time to roll it again. Time to roll it again. I'm let's gonna roll see. it this time. All right. Let's see what the I'm dice throw is it here. high up. Ready? Yeah, okay. and... Oh no! Woo! First one to the right. One. One, and then the third street, left. Left. Run up the stairs with your bike. <laughs> Let's go, guys. A little bit of cardio. <laughs> okay, so in the Netherlands, the cool thing is they have these on the steps where you can just roll your bike up. We don't have this in the US, so. It's my first time using one of these. <laughs> so we're now at the bridge over the train tracks. So they built this bridge to get even faster to the center. And um, you can't see it really, but behind this big tower, there's a dump tower, the famous tower of Utrecht. So uh, let's see if we can uh, go underneath it. And then, um, Third street to the left. This is the biggest bicycle parking of the world. 12 and 100,000 places. And there's still more to come. Second street. Oh, turning left. 
unfortunately, uh, we can't cycle here, so uh, we'll go by foot for a little while. Okay, sounds good. And then good. we throw the dice if we are out of the dump tower. This is a funny thing. They, uh, that is the dump tower. It's being rebuilt now, so yeah. that's why it has the cover. But as you can see here, they rebuilt the dump tower oh, on, on the, the ground. ground. And it's to show how long it is. So we're actually now a dump tower distance from the dump tower. Oh, wow. Cool. That's cool, right? If it's falling down, it will land there. Let's pop it over here. We're now at the Oudegracht, and this is like uh, the city center of the old town. So uh, yeah, this is really nice, and you can see there's a lot of people here. This is Rhyme Utrex. Yeah. This is the, the highlight of the city, I guess. That's cool, and they have literally bikes in the canals. They have too. bikes in the canals. What yeah, are those yeah, yeah. It's city water bikes. City like they're water re bikes. relatively new. How did you get into this biking thing? It's just the culture of the Netherlands, and then you just became super into it, and now you just bike <laughs> casually 100 kilometers like yesterday. Like how did this? How did this happen? <laughs> Well, it's actually a, a kind of a very uh, random, random story because I uh, I worked as a, a bicycle teacher and I did that also as a job on the side and then I started working like uh, as my regular job in the bicycle promotion and then I saw that they were looking for a bicycle mayor and I thought wow that's that's really something and I really want to try that so I wrote a working plan and uh, what I wanted to do with the city and they chose me so uh, that's how I became the bicycle mayor. What do you want people to know about biking for people that aren't as used to it? They're not living in the Netherlands, <laughs> the rest of the world. It's amazing, you should try it. <laughs> yeah, I just really love cycling and I, I would just recommend everyone to, to try it and, and to see how it feels and maybe start on a beautiful sunny day like today and make it make it a party, like uh, have, a, have a coffee uh, on the way or uh, grab an ice cream and uh, I'll promise you, you'll love cycling. In a sort of way, sometimes cycling can feel like you're floating, like you're floating on the, on the road and I guess when you're like going Going through, through the trees and in nature, and yeah, it's just uh, it feels like a dream. Can we pick up Ruth here? So uh, yeah, this is where the dice brought us. This is the dump square. We have the dump tower over there, and this is the dump church. And that used to be connected, but during a storm in the Netherlands, like it broke down the middle part, and it took the city forever to clean up the ruins. And uh, now we have this beautiful square here. This is the university building, Academiegebouw, uh, which is also really beautiful. And we could also go to the garden belonging to the church, and it's called the uh, Academietuin. Into the garden. Oh, look at this. So the dice brought us here, and actually it's time to throw the yeah. dice again. Okay. But I have one more surprise for you. So I like surprises. I'm gonna poop them away. Okay. And I'm gonna bring you to the final surprise. Okay. I like surprises. Let's see where you got in store for us. So I had a surprise plan for you, mm -hmm. namely kennel biking, <laughs> yeah. so cycling and uh, being on the water because the Dutch are known for the water and for cycling. So if you want to experience Utrecht in its fullest form, I thought kennel biking would be perfect, but there are no kennel bikes available. So that won't work out. I have to come up with another plan for you. And I'm thinking I should give you some destinations to go to and then uh, you could experience Utrecht by yourself because unfortunately I have to leave you. You could go to the Wilhelmina Park, uh -huh. which is a beautiful park, and it has a super nice bicycle path through the park. And, and not that far away from here, in the Forstad, they made a new bicycle road. And it's like a really long road where there's not so much traffic. It's really quiet, and like they made it a bike bicycle priority lane. So uh, th those are the tips I want to give you. Okay. And then I really enjoyed it. Thank you so much. And then uh, I'll say Thank you goodbye. so much. This is amazing. And enjoy your trip. I appreciate it. All right. Thank you. All right, guys, we are now on our own. So we're going to be going to one of the spots that he recommended to us, which is the park. And it is just going to be like a straight shot. And then I think we'll see the park. We're just about here. We are professional bikers now. 
made it to the park. It's so beautiful here, so much green. People are literally just like sitting on the side here having picnic with their friends. This is really nice. This morning was fantastic, but this is a really nice way to end the afternoon with a more peaceful bike ride through the park. We have been biking around this park, just chilling, <laughs> soaking it all in. But that was very nice to end this video. It's so green and beautiful here. And thank you so much again to the bicycle, Mayor of Utrecht, <laughs> for taking us around today. That was so fun. Over and out. See you later. Over and out. See you later. See you in the next one. Follow and subscribe. <laughs> Follow and subscribe. We're back. Follow and subscribe. If you liked it, click that thumb button so you get that, alerts. Click that subscribe button. Uh, subscribe? <laughs> There's <laughs> subscribe. something else that you're supposed to click. You can turn the notification bell. Yeah, turn that, turn that bell on. <laughs> Do that on. thing get, too. Get the ding. Yeah, it'll be good. Get that ding. All right, see y'all in Amsterdam. Red light district. Amsterdam. Amsterdam. Red light district and coffee shops. All right, bye. See you.